Hello out there. Today we are going to take a challenge from Pentester Lab. It is called Recon Doll. And in this particular challenge, we have to uh, understand the concept of load balancer and importance of load balancer in pen testing. Load balancer is a kind of application that helps application to optimize their response time to the user. You can see from the graph, uh, you can see from the image right for yourself. Because whenever you are just uh, requesting a, a resource from a web server, then web server will first time deliver your request as it is. When you are when you are requesting for the second time, it will try to tag that request whether the, whether the resource is has already been given to you or it is first uh, first time being uh, supplied to you. Okay, this way basically the applications will help to understand that whether the caching is required or not. Now, when application grow bigger in size like Facebook, so you cannot uh, have a, a situation when only a single server will cater to the need of each and every user. So what, what they do, they basically, uh, they will have a lots of web server at the back and they'll put a load balance at the front, which will basically, uh, you know, accepting all the uh, requests from the client and load balance accordingly, pass that or forward that request in the reverse proxy way and forward that request to the application server at the back. Okay. So uh, in this particular video, I have just tried to, um, you know, create a uh, Python script to help and detecting a load balancer because detecting load balancer is very much important in pen testing as well because un until and unless you don't have a proper application and its ip you cannot give a right report to your client okay so it's very important now what this python script will do it will just try to compare on different different uh, parameters http parameters it will just uh, first of all try to check the e tags as i've told you e tags are the entity tag that is basically tagged to the resources whenever they are uh, you know requested from a web server and uh, if you are finding that e-tags are varying, that means there is some kind of application servers are, you know, are different behind the load balancer. You can see I just, uh, I'm using an application um, that is the Python application to, you know, resolve a domain called hackerone.com and it will say that the DNS load balancer has been used. You can, uh, I have already uploaded this script in my uh, GitHub repo and you can further customize it or fork it and according to your users. Uh, uh, now coming back to challenge, I'll be using the same script to you know find out the application hosted on the balancer.hackycop.com and uh, you see that in no time it will give the flag stored in it. Okay, so that is the importance of a load balancer and I hope uh, so far my effort to you know I'm able, uh, effort to mix the Python with the pen testing is helping you a bit to you know increase your skill set uh, to becoming a cyber security expert. Uh, you know, you always take a baby step because uh, you, you cannot expect that all of a sudden you'll grow big and you'll just be doing a lot of things. So uh, take a small, small step at a time. Uh, try to understand the basics and uh, nitty gritty of the networking and, uh, you know, web applications and then uh, the road to OSCP will be much more clear to you. Okay. So uh, before I just, you know, uh, end my video, I, one more request to you. Thank you for all of your love so, so far that we have received. And if you think that uh, we need any kind of improvement, please reach out to us uh, through our comment, and uh, we'll be help. Uh, we'll be very much happy to incorporate all your you know uh, suggestions. At the same time, if you're finding our resources helpful to you, then please recommend to your friends as well, and subscribe my channel and uh, press the bell icon so that you can get the instant notification whenever the next uh, video is up. Uh, sorry, this time I have taken a little longer to post my uh, next video because of certain engagement. Um, but uh, I hope that uh, I'll be maintaining a more continuity now in posting my videos uh, henceforth. And uh, you see, I have uh, just in the meantime, you can see that I've already completed the challenge and uh, retrieved the key. So thank you and have a great day.